everyone and welcome to this week's show of 10 Reasons Why. Now if I sometimes go down like this, I look totally naked. So just to confirm I'm not totally naked, I have a top on. Often I'm asked how long it takes me to record my show each week. I'd probably say it took me about a day with the researching and writing and getting a pretend boyfriend in and the filming and the editing. But one of the main reasons it does actually take me so long is because I spend the majority of the time doing this. And sometimes I just don't know what to say. Hello, and welcome. So, now we've all come to realise I am vain and stupid, let's get on with this week's show. This week I'm going to be discussing one of my favourite topics to talk about, dating. And in particular, the first date. Sometimes first dates can be magical, sometimes they can be fucking shit. So I think the uncertainty of not knowing how a first date's gonna go, it's just better to keep it short. And here are 10 reasons why. One, I think most people, well, I certainly do, know if there's an instant spark when you first meet someone. And if there isn't, there's just no point in dragging out the torture. I mean, who likes faking it? Right, girls? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Were you faking that by any chance? Two. Let's be honest, it's pretty standard practice for the guy to pay on the first date, which is obviously good for us, but not so good for them. Oh, nearly finished my wine. What's a girl to do? Waiter, can we get another wine for the lady and maybe a remortgage of my house because I assume that I'm going to be fucking paying again? So, all in all, men, shorter dates will cost you less. Three. Now, I think on the whole, women generally have less commitment issues than men. So although a long first date might seem amazing at the time, it's not good for those who are freaked out by commitment. Chris? Yes. Hi. Hi. Emily, nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Hi. How's it going? Uh, yeah, good. Good. So, how was your day? <sighs> I'm sorry, this is way too intense. But I've got massive breasts! Four. That's not four. Four. If you have a long first date, there is the worry that one of you is going to overshare, and that's just not good for anyone. So, so where did you grow up? I've got herpes. Oh, I probably shouldn't have said that, should I? Five! The longer the date, the more drunk you're going to get. Is that just me? Liars. So, where were we? Oh, I love you! What? I just love you, I don't know what whoa, to whoa, do. Whoa, I love whoa. you! Hey, whoa <laughs> I never learn. Six. If you keep the date short, you get to your next one on time. Seven. Now it's easy to agree with each other on the first date because you want to make the best impression. So do you like Take That? My god, yeah, I love Take That. Do you like horse riding? Horse riding, yeah, I love it. Just the, the feel of the saddle when you're, when you're trotting through, just, it just rubs against the, the penis. It's... But by staying on the date longer, you're just going to run the risk of your cover being blown. I just can't wait to have kids. I love them. Um, how many kids do you want? Kids? None. But I, I, would, I would like a midget. Not in a, not in a weird sexual way. Just to have as, have as maybe a, a, a pet, and you know, I, if that's a thing you can have. But I'd be good to it. I'd let it run and dig and forage for truffles or whatever it is that they do. What? Eight! Now quite a few have told me that I wear a lot of makeup. Sometimes too much, yes I know. Fuck you! I can wear however much makeup I like. However, because I do like wearing quite a lot of makeup, if the date goes on longer, I just run the risk of putting too much on because I'm so drunk I can't see what I'm doing. And I basically end up looking like a drag queen. No one's gonna wanna tap that. Nine? It's a fact. A lot of girls puke when they're drunk. So it's just best to keep the date short in case you end up puking in front of him. Yeah, so, I mean, I, I, I haven't seen my sister for quite a few years now, but it's... it's oh, are you, you all right? No. Oh. <coughs> are you... Are you, are you... <coughs> oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. That's embarrassing. Sorry, what were you saying? Got a bit of carrot just there. Yeah, I didn't get a second date after that. And ten. Keeping the first date short leaves them wanting more. Some very long days, but, you know, I enjoy what I do, Ooh. and so... Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. I don't like to have a watch on, but um, I'm pretty sure it's fucking late. I've got to get really early, so... See you later. No. Oh. But I love her. 
Now this week, I'm actually going to be letting someone else do my pajama dance because I was sent this amazing video of these two children doing pajama dance. I mean, I'm guessing their mum or dad told them to do this because I don't think a five-year-old and a seven-year-old are really supposed to be watching my videos. So I don't know your names who uploaded this video and sent it to me, but I think it's amazing and thank you. That's actually got me thinking. I'd love to see your guys' interpretation of my pajama dance. And then each week, that would save me thinking of something new to do in my fucking pajamas, and I can just use your videos. Works for both of us. I thought I'd add in some outtakes this week because um, some of them were pretty special. Horse riding, oh, I, I love it. I just, oh, they... <laughs> Going really well, by the way. You don't do outtakes, do you? Oh, I do. Do you? Hence why it keeps rolling. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, you should have. You may want to watch the look I did to camera. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. These are going to be outtakes, and you're never going to get a date ever again. Yeah. Just, I want okay. the girl to do. Right. Yeah, 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 that's a really cunty line to say. <laughs> What's a girl Sorry, to I was, do? Sorry, I was still smiling. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, ah! Ooh! Oh. Right, so we've come to the end of this week's show. I never know what to say at the end of every video. Goodbye? Is that enough? Miss you? Yeah, that's too much. <laughs>